A couple of black entrepreneurs have teamed up to add some light to your Valentine's Day. If you need something to capture those sweet, sweet moments of black love, the Moon Ultra Light has you covered. I spoke to the CEO of the company who tells me why this gift will have your loved one smiling a little brighter this holiday. Tell me about Moon Ultra Light. I want to know all about it. Absolutely, yeah. So it's a it's it's been a labor of love and and a project that has meant so much to me. Um, uh, it essentially started because we, my, my wife and I wanted to take a ton of photos um, to really capture moments because my well, our son our youngest son is autistic, and so because we always had great photos during the daytime but lacked really great photos during the nighttime, we thought well there needs to be a solution here, and there really wasn't anything to solve that problem. So one night in a restaurant, we sort of came up with an idea, and um, the idea for Moon Ultra was born. So what does this thing do? I mean, I gotta I'll take and unzip it here. Yeah, so I'll, t I'll show you right now. It's uh, a yeah, small little baby. It, yeah, there it goes. Yeah, so essentially how it works is, you know, if you pic picture yourself in an environment where you wanted to take a photo or a video of yourself, or you wanted to maybe, you know, get on a FaceTime call with, with loved ones, but there's really no good light and you're in a dark restaurant or a dark environment. Um, so you can attach Moon to your phone and it works with touch. So each side of the sen has a sensor on each side for left and right. And then you can touch both sides and then it will turn on. And once it's on, you can then start to adjust your brightness. So I can dim it down, I can brighten it up as much as I need. And also I can switch it into a mode, which is color mode. And that allows you to be able to t change the color temperature. So I can make it a lot more warmer or a lot more cooler, depending on my preference. Uh, and of course, because it's universal, you can adapt it to any device. So different phones, tablets, uh, but also the best part too, is that you can actually just sort of hold it, right? So if you're in a restaurant, you wanted to capture a picture of some awesome food that you just got. Uh, you can hold your phone up, hold your moon up, and grab that nice shot, get back to dinner. I love that. How did you come up with the name? Oh, that was a, a wild way of thinking about it. So my, um, that's actually probably the first time anyone's asked me that. <laughs> so great question. Uh, my co-founder and I were sort of sitting around and thinking, what should we call this product? And I started to really think about like lighting for photography and video. And people generally ask me, hey, Ed, what's the best light I should use when I'm taking a photo? I'm like, day is it? They're like, well, it's daytime sunlight. That's the best source of light during the daytime. And then we're thinking, well, what's the best source of light at night? Uh, the moon. <laughs> and that's literally how that came, came to be. I love it. Perfect stuff. We like, and I mean, we all got to have that good lighting. I'm like crazy about that. So, I mean, talk Absolutely. about how this has kind of changed the dynamics of your typical family photo or a couple's photo or something like that. I mean, just thinking about like, if you think about the photos you've seen, whether on social media, or Facebook, Instagram, and you see those dark grainy photos, I think people in general sometimes don't even realize that they're lacking good quality photos. Yet we have these expensive phones in our hands. Our phones can do just about anything. I mean, launch a rocket if we wanted to, but our photos aren't that great. So I found, I found it so odd. And now the difference is if you look at the before photos from before we had moon in our lives to now, every photo we, we, we capture in a dark environment is just beautiful. Um, and the best part about it is you're seeing the light in real time. So you don't have to guess, you know, when you think about like flash photography, it's you take the photo and then you wait for the flash to burst. And then you look at your phone and you go, that's not a good one. Let's try again. Or as moon, you can take it, hold it up to something, take your photo and you can see it in real time that, Oh, this is going to be a good shot hit the trigger and you have a good photo and then you can get back to whatever moment you were in. I just had this idea to take two phones and mash them together and turn one of the lights on and use them as, as one phone. And, and when, when that happened, there was actually a lady, two tables from us who saw me do this act and replicated it halfway through dinner. I'm looking up and she's doing the same thing. And I realized, wait a minute, there's actually a bigger problem. We're not the only ones. And the idea hit me in that moment. And I went home and began, you know, the idea of creating the concept and all of that. So uh, it was, it was just sort of maybe serendipity that I happened to be a cinematographer and, and I knew photography and light and I was able to like realize there was a, something there. Um, but it, it took a little bit of time just to turn it from the idea that I had into reality. That took me finding my co-founder, uh, building an exceptional team. I love my team. They're like family to me. And, and then creating this amazing product together and then launching it and giving it out to the world. Tell people why this is the best gift to probably get somebody. If you think about, you know, uh, relationships, whether they're family relationships or friendship relationships or, you know, um, a loving relationships between a couple, uh, it's all about moments. Um, there's really nothing better than a moment. And I think 
uh, you know, we live in, a, in an age where we're so lucky that unlike our parents or our grandparents, they had to take a photo, go develop it, and then come back and find out if that photo was actually good or not. And, you know, you go to, I don't know if you remember going to CVS or Walgreens and, and looking at your photo album, and like, oh, this photo came out really bad. And I was hoping it was a great moment. Mm -hmm. um, and we have the ability to now capture thousands and thousands of photos at a time. And I think what this will do for any couple out there during Valentine's is be, be able to capture that moment and get back to the actual moment that matters. Because you want to be able to go back and relive that moment and say, oh, you know, we, were, we went out to dinner at this place. It was amazing. We took a photo together. And you can go back and you can swipe through your photos one day and be able to relive that moment and not be disappointed by the fact that you had an amazing moment, but the photo ruined that moment for you and that memory. So I think it's the best gift to get your loved one. Um, and it's just in general, great gift for anyone who has family or anyone they care about. They really want to have these moments to cherish forever. You gotta love that. Well, if you're interested in the Moon Ultralight, you can find them on moonultralight.com or follow them on social media at My Moon Ultra.